Hello and thanks for watching this series of videos on Acumatica 2020 R2, a preview of features. So in this video, we're going to talk about the CRM enhancements that have been made to 2020 R2. So the first one is under business accounts, we use business accounts as a way for visibility of vendors and customers. So you can see here, there's a list of different vendors and customers. There's types right here. And if we open up a customer, under contacts, what Acumatica has done is it's given us the ability to define which contact is the primary contact. So for example, Sam Malone will set it as the primary. And when we go over to details, we now on this screen, we can see the primary contact. This information has been exchanged with under CRM info, with your class ID for the business account and what work group is working this business account, who's responsible for it, contact preferences and all that. So this information has been flipped. And again, now we have the ability to set as a primary. Additionally, we now have the ability to pin activities that are important to us. This functionality has been added to opportunities, cases, and leads. So if we take a look at an existing opportunity, you'll notice we now have the ability to pin or unpin the activity. This will keep your most important activities up here at the top on this screen. And once again, this extends to opportunities, leads, and support cases. Lastly, if we open up a customer, Acumatica has mail settings. These mail settings give you the ability to dictate what reports and what notification templates you use for different types of documents in Acumatica. It also gives you the ability to add certain recipients to a specific customer. So if I change to USA Bartender and I switch over to our sales order notification, you'll notice we have a couple of different contacts that get notified when a sales order notification is sent out. Now Acumatica gives you the ability to override the recipients. Now previously it would add the recipients. Now what does this mean? What this means is that Acumatica also takes into consideration the customer class. So when we look at the customer class, it's the category of the customer, we have mail settings here too. So when we look at our sales order notification, notice employee David Chubb gets CC'd to every single sales order notification that goes out for this category of customers, key customers. Now, if we go back and we go back to our mail settings for this customer, by default, the system adds the recipients, meaning it combines all the recipients that are supposed to get this against the customer. But if I select override recipients, that's what's new here, and I save it, we now have only the recipients that are part of this customer. So we get the option to control who gets communicated on a particular document notification. And this area allows you to add additional notifications, additional reports. You can customize, for example, this customer gets a different sales order notification template or a different sales order form. So this whole area is very useful in Acumatica. What's new is your ability to control who gets notified when these automatic emails go out the door. So that's the CRM enhancements to Acumatica 2020 R2. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.